will electric motorcycles be as convenient as petrol motorcycles for daily use there's no simple answer to this question right range anxiety is a real thing but tell me this how much distance does an average city rider travel in a day um 30 40 kilometers give or take right so the average indian today rides about 16 to 20 kilometers a day the average electric motorcycle or two wheeler today easily offers a range of about 120 kilometers which is roughly about three times the distance that you would travel daily but why do people still have this range anxiety as a problem let me explain this with a very simple analogy right do you remember the old keypad phones we never worried about how much charge was left in these phones for at least three days we would just use them and whenever it runs out of battery you simply charge them just like how petrol vehicles have like a reserve option to indicate low fuel right but when we moved to smartphones things changed charging frequency increased which created anxiety leading us to plan well in advance of when we charge overnight right this is the same thing that's happening with electric two wheelers as well but charging them for just a couple of hours overnight or in the morning like how we charge our mobiles is enough to take three times the distance we would travel in a day and our motorcycles can travel through 150 kilometers on a single charge that's what we're bringing at rapti right which means you only have to charge roughly once or twice a week which is still much less often than how we would charge your mobile right and that is just gonna be a matter of habit before you know we get used to how we charge and use our vehicles right sure so say uh 150 kilometers right uh on one rare day i use 150 kilometers uh even before i can reach home in that case do we have enough charging options charging stations right i'll use the same analogy right what type of charger does your phone use a uh, c type would you agree if i say a c type charger is kind of a universal charger sure so now if you ask somebody in your office you're more likely to find a type c charger but getting a type b charger will be very difficult right right it's the same scene with ev charging infrastructure as well See, we already have an expanding charging infrastructure. There are more than 12,000 chargers already in India, with private players adding a lot more over and above that to capitalize on the growing EV trend. Today, we see charging stations in most petrol pumps, hotels, and even in park parking lots, but they're not compatible with two wheelers. To put it in simple terms, these public charging stations are like USB C, right? Widely available, but only cars are compatible with them. And while two wheelers are still in the type B stage, still very incompatible. Right. At Rapid and HP, we've broken this barrier with high voltage technology in our motorcycles, making them compatible with the widely available car charging infrastructure. So if you're on Rapid and HP, you never have to worry about range anxiety anymore.